Hi guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel. I just got home from work. The time is 10.50. There's like, I'm upstairs right now. Um, tomorrow's a big day, tomorrow's moving day. The movers are gonna be here at 8.30 in the morning. It's now, let's just round it up. It's 11 p.m. And my house is completely empty and I need to take a shower and decompress to mentally prepare for my long, long day tomorrow. Right now I'm gonna show you my house, the empty house that I lived in for the past, how long have I lived here? Maybe like five, six years now I think I lived here in this house. So uh, I'm just gonna really quickly go over uh, what's staying, what's leaving really fast. Hopefully you guys can see. Let's see, I can turn the lights on here. All right, so this is a two family home that I lived in. This couch is coming with me to my studio until I can get the couch that I want. The couch that I want is like $3,000. So um, instead of just giving this one away, it'll be a while before I get that couch and it's back ordered. We are gonna take this to my studio. So this is coming, um, as you can see, I sold my bookcase that was here, I sold the TV stand that was here, the table um, donated, this table that was here was Taylor's, the bar that was here was Taylor's, and then the other Taylor took it. Um, the bar stools that were here, donation, and everything here, of course, it's stained. So all the cabinets were, are empty. Everything better be empty, I swear to God. Um, up here, there was three bedrooms. You guys have never seen these bedrooms on my channel. Then there's a closet over here. At nighttime, it's, there's a bathroom here. Bathroom, shower moment. Um, and then, another bedroom over here. Yeah, closet, and then the master bath was here. There's a master bathroom right here. Um, and then the master had, oh, there's two closets here, a balcony, and yeah. You guys can't see out there, but it's really cute. And it's like a garden, super cutesy. And yeah, so the movers are taking the couch. We've established that. Let me show you downstairs. I'm not hungry. I think I'm just like so excited. I don't, did I even eat like a real meal today? I don't remember. I did have pizza, but I need groceries. And then downstairs in the basement. Sorry, camera's a little shaky. Okay, so the movers are gonna come and take all of this stuff here in the corner. Um, doesn't seem like a lot. Everything's neatly packed and organized. The bike is gonna go. I want to go to Ikea. I will take you guys with me. This wine rack I'm gonna give away, and I'm also gonna give away my bed by leaving it out on the corner. Um, but there's a wine rack at, I at Ikea that I love, that I like, that I'm gonna buy, so that one's saying goodbye to that and then all these boxes uh it's pretty much just kitchen stuff and my riding boots my jumping juice my dressage boots i have a box of wine here um this will probably go in my car this is just junk the bathroom's empty uh then i have a situation over here where i've been doing laundry and so these clothes here are now clean and the wash and dryer of course is stained but then I have a situation here where these are, this is like me living out of my suitcase for the past 24 hours. So I have a work luggage here and I have two tote bags. And I have clothes here in this closet. I have three closets in this house. Um, it's the first closet. This is the second closet here. All of this needs to come. The closets are empty here and there's nothing here on the shelves anymore. And then the bedroom, excuse my bed, it's a mess. But um, 
the bed has got to go. We are over it. I'm over her. I'm going to have the movers break her down and just set her out on the curb tomorrow. And then this mirror is coming with the table that was here and my purse stand that was here behind this door. So you guys remember here I gave away. Um, and then the desk here, threw it away. All the clothes are coming. Just the bed and the box spring is coming. And then, of course, my dresser is coming. So, that is everything. It's not a lot. The move should not take long. But this is... Today and tomorrow are the last day that you'll see this house. And then we will be off into my new apartment. My new, um, luxury studio, which I'm very excited to move into. I'm also very stressed. I have been trying to keep my stress levels down and whatever the hell I've been doing has not been working. So, um, hopefully tomorrow I'll be less stressed. Uh, they come at 8 in the morning, like I said. And so, I'm going to stop rambling. I told you guys my, this is my, pretty much my empty house tour of the old place. I don't think I've, I don't think I've ever given a tour. I'm going to take a shower. I wanted to look really cute for work. I haven't worn, um, a full face of makeup. In a long time and I even did my hair I brushed it I even curled it and then I realized why did I even curl my hair when I have to keep it pulled back and up at all times <laughs> so I have some little like last minute stuff that I need to do tomorrow I want to look cute I know um you know moving day be looking rough for most folk but I am going to try and put makeup on because that's when I feel better about myself and I want to feel really good tomorrow and I want to do a lot of unpacking tomorrow with you guys and I don't know when I, I don't know when I'm going to go to Ikea but I need to go to Ikea. Uh, maybe maybe in the middle of October I can be able to go to Ikea because I have to make a list of the things that I want and the things that I need. It's a huge difference and um, I want to pay cash for everything so I need to see how much of a budget needs to be anyway because I have to pay a lot of money tomorrow guys and I will disclose to you how much I have to pay tomorrow when the time comes but uh, I'm not sure if I want to tackle the clothes tonight or tackle the clothes in the morning like right before the movers get here <laughs> but I'll see you guys in the morning um, because we're moving to a new house baby My new house, my little studio. Well, it's not little, it's actually quite big. The movers moved everything from my old house. It took them two hours to load everything up, come all the way here, it was like 30 minutes away. Um, and there's an elevator in my building, so put everything in the service elevator, drop it off here. I made one stop to my house to pick up the rest of the stuff that I didn't want them to take. And we're here so I am going to unload and put everything away I sure am all in one day the time right now is 12 21 so we're doing pretty good the movers came at 8 30 and I know I was like I'm gonna wear makeup mm -mm, I don't know what that I think Ashley yesterday was feeling cute and was feeling pretty um but Ashley today was like all right <laughs> you need to be realistic so I have these huge windows that go all the way to the ceiling here but anyway I'm getting too far ahead of myself I need this couch it's not gonna work in here it's just not gonna work in here um so over the next year you guys are gonna see this place definitely transform uh let me show you what I'm working with right now uh this is the front door here um, I have a closet here. All this needs to be put away. I will do a tour whenever I'm done. This mirror, I don't know where I'm going to put it. All this stuff. This is my shower. Um, this is the... Guys, look how tall these, these ceilings are so high. This door is ginormous, but my washer and dryer is in here. My pantry is in here. My kitchen, you can't see. It's back there. Um, the apartment came with an island. You can't see because there's a whole bunch of crap on there. I have all these boxes here. All of this needs to be put away or thrown away. Um, I decided to leave my bed. My dresser's over here. 
Uh, this is my box spring, the couch. The mattress is here and the closet is ginormous. Absolutely uh, ginormous. So yeah, these are not even all my clothes. <laughs> I just put them there because that's what I came from the car. So um, let's go ahead and uh, unpack, unpack everything. And I'm gonna be like a little mouse. I'm gonna do little sections at a time. And the first things first is I'm going to organize the couch, the dresser, and the box spring and the mattress until I decide if I want to put a bed frame in this apartment or not. So since there are so many tie, tie, high and tall boxes, um, I'm just going to put you guys on a time lapse and pray to God that my battery won't die, which I know that it will. I just don't know where the new batteries are. So I'll just be using my phone if my camera dies, okay? <laughs> All right, let's get started. You, if I were to lose you now, I don't know what I might do. This is the state of my apartment. This bike is still sitting here. I don't know what to do with it. Uh, the island is still covered. This stuff right here is kitchen stuff. Um, these are books. I don't have any place to put all my books and I really kind of want them on display. I'm gonna have to get like a entry table here or a bookshelf or something. Uh, the closet's coming along nicely. Um, I do decide to leave my chair in there just to pull out if I need to put my shoes on uh, boots up there um, clothes keep coming out of the woodwork so I have clothes here on the bed that need to be put away in the dresser and uh, I have clothes in this bin that also need to be put away I'm trying to figure out what needs to be thrown away it's my these are where all my electronics are right here in this bad boy but we're coming along guys we are coming along there's still crap in the bathroom this is what i'm using for like my utility closet like i did in the other house does this light turn on this entry light oh it does it's nice so i still i'm gonna put my winter coats in here i have my boots um all in this basket right here my hunter boots i have my work luggage here i have my big luggage here in the corner my riding boots, my helmet, and then I do have my um, rolling rack in here for when I want to do like a clothing haul. And then inside this bin is just um, an old laptop, some towels, like light bulbs in here, my little tool kit from Ikea. This is my United case that I have to have some stuff in. Um, this, I believe, is jewelry in this Yves Saint Laurent box. 
my mannequin head, my blow dryer. So it's like random miscellaneous stuff. Yes, I'm gonna put that in here, I believe. I might also wanna put my bike in here, I think. I don't know if I should put my bike in here or put it in my clothing closet where I just strictly want it to be closed. So I'm not sure what to do. We'll Almost done. Now the pantry. <sighs> and then we'll be done with pretty much this. Oh, I'm preheating my oven because I have some pizza from the other night here. Now the pantry. All my seasoning, guys. So much seasoning. I cooked a proper meal, but baby got seasonings, okay? We got seasonings. All right, guys, I'm making progress. The time is now five o'clock, and I'm almost done. I just have to tackle the bathroom, which seems to be um, the last thing. I'm, the bathroom just seems like such a tedious thing to do. Um, I did one box at a time, one little area of um, the space at a time. So I'm pretty happy. I don't know when I'm gonna be able to organize my closet by color and shorts and jeans and all that. That's just gonna have to be a project for another day. I do have a bunch of bips and bobs, pretty much candles, along here. Along my window seal here, I have no idea what to do with, but look how high my windows are. And, um, yeah, just stuff. I'm not gonna hang anything because I haven't lived in here long enough, but this red thing, the fire alarm, it's not an eyesore, it doesn't bother me. I don't think I'm gonna cover it up. The couch for sure is too big. This is the only walking space that I'm able to have. Um, and anytime, right now, the doors are just gonna have to stay open because since the couch is so big, the bed is also in the way. So either I keep I can keep one door closed, which I may do that, but this door here, I'm having a hard time opening and closing because of this entire setup. So this is my little junk box here that I'm gonna go through. Um, but the kitchen is all set up and it is cute. Uh, there's my air fryer here that my grandmother got me. I have the rug, I have the trash can. So when you walk into the house, that's not the first thing you see. I have nothing in the refrigerator. The pantry is done. Um, it's not home edit approved yet. My crock pot down here, but it will be home edit, home edit approved um, soon. Not a really a big, big worry at the moment. This is all recycling garbage. This. I want to put here on the entry hallway and then these are books, two bags, books, magazines, and I also think this box here is books. Um, so yeah, the bathroom is next. I have all this stuff here on the floor as you guys can see. So we're going to tackle that. This is also recycle right here. Um, I have pizza in the oven. I think I'm gonna take it out now because it's nice and brown and burnt like how I like it. <sighs> so another thing that's pretty cool uh, about my new apartment complex is that I have um, commercial size wash and dryer complimentary to the residents that live here. So right now I have my comforter in there. It's drying right now. It's been drying for like two and a half, three hours. <laughs> um, so I'm gonna take you guys with me to go grab that and then um, I'm gonna break these boxes down first. Then we'll drop them off at my um, rubbish chute and my recycle chute. Then we will go grab the uh, comforter. <laughs> oh, finally, a clear entryway. No, plus this demon. <laughs> Everything else is done. 
The island though needs to be cleaned off. <sighs> All right. You guys, I'm so tired. But I'm so happy to get this done out of the way. Like, I am not one of those people who can do a couple boxes a day. Like, I just can't live in clutter like that. Everything has to be done. So. <sighs> the nice thing about this wash and dryer is that it's right below me. Like, literally, right below my apartment. It looks just like a regular laundromat. Um, so you have three washers here and three dryers. You have a sink, trash, and laundry bins. Done! Where are my keys? <laughs> you need to add these keys on my car keys so I don't lose them. It's nice though it isn't really, a, I only have a key, like a real key um, for my mailbox. But in order to get inside my apartment, it's a key fob, which is so nice. Oh. There's also a, hold on. I don't want it to be an echo. Um, there's a rooftop. I can use the other apartment complex that were built to same building. There's a phase one. This one that I'm living in is phase two. And there's a rooftop grill, big like community area, business center, yoga, everything. So maybe one day I'll give you guys a tour. Maybe not. I don't need people knowing where I'm living. Oh gosh. I'm sorry. All right, let's make my bed. That is made. Uh, this is as good as it's going to get. I don't use a loose sheet. I just use a fitted sheet. Very European. I know, I know, I know. Alrighty, let's eat something. Drink some water. And then tackle the bathroom and this island. 5:48. Almost done. Mm -hmm. Hi guys. Good evening. The time is 7 p.m. The house is done. I have one project tomorrow, which is trying to declutter some duffel bags that I have. So I'm very, very happy. The utility closet is done. The bathroom is done. Um, I'm making a to-do list of things that I need, like a shower caddy. Uh, but I'll just show you the bathroom really fast there's really nothing to it it's huge walk-in shower i have my two rugs here i have my little baskets of toilet paper the toilet and then on top of the toilet i just put in my crest rice strips uh q-tips and some floss sticks i organized this a little there's really nothing here it's sunday rally products Lemair products soap q-tips and then underneath here is literally nothing but cleaning products and a couple of hair products. So lots of cleaning going on down here. I have my body wash, face wash, my microfiber cloth, um, just a white towel. And yeah, the back of the door looks like this. There's a hook. And yeah, it's 
pretty freaking big. I'm not even lying. You can easily fit like eight people in this bathroom. So there's that. The utility closet is done. I did, I don't think I, did I show you guys? I put my bike in here. The bike is in. The luggage, the big luggage up top. The helmet's there. The clothes are here, work luggage. We're in there like swimwear, honey. Um, the laundry room. Let me switch positions here. Ooh, washer, dryer. I got my hamper right here. I have my drying rack right here. Broom, Swiffer, and then these were the four um, prints that were above my bed in the last place. I'm not going to hang anything yet. Like I said, I want to live in the place for a while. I showed you guys the pantry, the refrigerator. These are some London magnets. My Brita water filters in here. Look. <laughs> my lemon curd, butter, Parmesan cheese from Trader Joe's, kimchi in here, and then I have potatoes and a bagel. That's it. Brita water filter. My freezer is down here. Pretty deep freezer. I have an ice maker here. Thank the Lord. So happy about that. <sighs> There's dinner. This is my, I mean, what is a cookbook? We don't know her. Uh -huh. This is my architectural digest from Italy that I picked up when I was in Milan. Candle, just some bips and bobs here and there. My kettle. Um, I was able to put my wine here. I think I showed you guys that. Um... Everything else is pretty much self-explanatory. The bed, I actually like it. Like this, the couch, like I said, we need to downsize her. And the closet is done. I just have to do a reorganize, recoloring, jeans, dresses, all that jazz. Um, the shoes I'm okay with, the chair I'm okay with for now. Um, the project is these three, four tote bags tomorrow. This is an entire bag full of makeup. This is what I'm going back and forth between on like, what I've been living out of. This bag here is my turn bag um, when I do like one day trips for work. So <sighs> I did a lot guys. I did a lot today. I'm gonna give myself a pat on the back. Um, mm -mm, whoopsie, my feet done, done for, okay? This floor looks like I'm gonna be cleaning it all the time. <laughs> And yeah, I'm a happy girl. I'm blessed. I'm so grateful to be in my new place. Um, for a while there, I was worried. Um, I wasn't sure if I was going to be able to qualify uh, for the place because, you know, living in New Jersey, New York, you need to make like 80 times the rent. So I don't know why I was doubting myself. Um, yeah, it was just a doubt that I had. So my dad was like, you were already doubting yourself before you even applied for the place. I was like, I know, I know. But anyway, we are here. <laughs> we are here in my new studio. So thank you guys for watching. I'll see you guys tomorrow. I have to get my hair done tomorrow. Um, and then the Wi-Fi is coming tomorrow. And then I have to go to work on Friday, I think, on the 1st of October. So I have Wi-Fi tomorrow. So I get to edit and upload some videos, y'all. Don't be mad at me. Don't be mad at me about how these videos have been coming and going. and not coming at all um but i have been almost two or three weeks without wi-fi <sighs> but wi-fi is coming tomorrow i'm about to chill good night <laughs>